Enemy fans, Mrs. May here. Thank you so much for watching this video. It's a domination game I played on Mission. And I'm only putting the end part of it because, like most of you already know, domination games typically last at least 10 minutes. And, you know, quite honestly, I don't know what to talk about for 10 minutes. Um, I'm actually struggling to talk about anything right now. But that's beside the case. I want to use this time to actually introduce myself and let you guys know who I am. I am May. I am 24 years old. And I absolutely love mangoes and I don't have enough of it. Um, if you've known me, that's typically how I introduce myself. Um, I don't know how to do a whole about me bio thing. I can't really talk too much about myself and it always makes me feel awkward. Well, I'm just a naturally awkward person. So, um, yeah. Anyway, I, I want to talk about what I do and what's my, you know, goals for this year as far as gaming and YouTube goes. Um, well, first of all, I've been gaming since, I don't know, when I was four. Um, I lived in the Philippines for a while um, until I was eight. And throughout that whole time, gaming, as far as it went, was NES and Sega and first place no was it the first PlayStation? No, not the first PlayStation. Just the NES and the Sega Genesis. And um I mean I absolutely love the NES. Like my favorite game of all time was Duck Hunt and Super Mario Brothers was like right behind it. Oh the other one was Super NES. Yeah that one. Okay anyway um and and that's how the love of gaming started for me. My dad lived here in the States um, and he would always like ship back like all these awesome games and I mean like it sometimes they wouldn't be they wouldn't be too awesome like anticipation but I still like I still spent so much time playing those games I just loved it I loved it um, so from then on I went to um, PlayStation when I get when I came here I actually went to the arcade a lot and I played a lot of DDR I mean to a point where I lost so much weight I like weighed 84 pounds because I didn't want to stop playing um so I played a lot of DDR but the arcade that we I, I live in Los Angeles so it's automatically like there's places that are gonna be more ghetto than usual um but my parents wanted me to stop going to this arcade because there's been reports about people getting shot or people going missing and so they bought me my very first PlayStation so that I could play at home. Yes, it was fun and I always did play at home. I played the DDR at home with a plastic mat that always slipped and unless you did something or like stuck it on something. I don't know. Like a bad little girl, like a rebel, like a boss. I still went back to the arcade and laid there. But it opened up so many things for me. I had this PlayStation and I I got like Star Ocean, I got Final Fantasy, like all these awesome games. And um, from then on from PlayStation, of course I got the PlayStation 2, played or tried playing a bunch of Resident Evil games. You know what? Quite honestly, I'm a pussy, so I really just couldn't do it. Like I, I couldn't finish this game. And um, among other things, some of the other consoles that I had, GameCube, Dreamcast actually had two of them. I don't know why. Um, and my favorite game in Dreamcast was the Sonic game. The Chows! The Chows were so cute! And, um, what else? Nintendo 64, my, um, an Xbox, the original, I actually got it modded and it broke, so I had to get rid of it. And then eventually I stopped gaming for a while. I went back into PC gaming and I played a lot of Counter Strike. Like we did scrims and everything. Um, and that was really technically my first FPS. Um, I played like, I think I started playing like 1.4. And I stopped playing in Source. I don't know why. I think it's because I moved from PC to console multiplayer. And um, from then on I started playing, um, I, I stopped for a little bit and I started playing. Um, Modern Warfare 2. I know I skipped. I, I played World of War campaign, but I didn't play the multiplayer and I skipped COD 4, which is such a sinful thing now because I know everyone's telling me it's one of the best games that you could really play um, as far as COD goes. You know, I will never know. I will never know the innocence of that because I know that when I started playing Modern Warfare 2, to me, it was amazing because I was so innocent to console multiplayer gaming 
and this was like so new to me and um i didn't think about lag i didn't think about you know spawn trapping or all these other things that people do and um so to me it was just all fun however when i got into black ops i love black ops by the way i think it's still the best cod game that i've ever played in my honest opinion um but yeah uh it's yeah black ops and then i started playing modern warfare 3 and i hate modern warfare 3 i don't want to play it anymore i don't know why i have that poster up there i think it's just there because my friend from gamestop gave it to me anyway i hope this commentary actually made sense i'm sorry if i started rambling but i hope to see you guys on my page and i'll see you guys online bye